that's what's so wonderful about land-based whale research. There's no noise under the water, and they can make the decision to come to you or not. When we got here and we put hydrophones in the water, we realized how special this place actually is, how quiet it is underwater. All of a sudden, there's this news of a proposal for oil tankers from Kitimat to Asia. All of a sudden, I realized, oh my god, this is going to be huge. We really mean no two tankers on our coastline in our territory. Dead land, dead water, we don't want that. All these boats would affect the sonar of the whales. This whole area is just one big bowl of whale food. What if a tanker comes out of there? So this is where LNG Canada will have their camp. We're very confident it's going to happen. What it is really, people making decisions on lands that they have no spiritual connection to. These whales have very, very strong bonds with each other. There is no aggression whatsoever. It is a community. These whales are ahead of us. And for us humans, we don't really like to hear that. The tankers on the coast, they'll be coming. What can you do?